everyone and welcome back. My name is Pandora and welcome to Primrose Lake. Uh, I can't remember what happened in the last one. I know the sheriff was talking to the librarian about something and trying to figure out whose glasses this is. So let's get us started. We are back at the cab. Now is not the time to relax. Hello, Jenny, are you here? I was wondering what kind of laptop I had. <laughs> wow, she really clean fixed the place. Is that vanilla? Nice. Jenny, are you here? It's me, Jess. I guess she took off. Can't blame her. I'd probably do the same thing in her shoes. Unless something happened to her. If that crazy guy from the sawmill found me, she wasn't, and found out she wasn't me. You all have blood on your hands. You will pay. Oh no, I should have warned her. How could I bring her to this place and not tell her anything? Chester McGowan had the mind of a, a Harvard scholar with the soul of a vagabond. The West called to him just as it did to J.W. When the two met, it was like steel on iron. Sparks flew and their lives were forever changed. Well, crap. Now, what am I supposed to think? supposed to think of this? Hmm, didn't I read something about a historical society in town? Looks like that's my next stop. I'm going back to the library. I think she's on to us. Now, don't forget to come back when you're finished with that book. Alright, you said you wanted, what was you in a tizzy? Chip, you know you, by now you know I'm not the kind of girl who gets into a tizzy. The sheriff showed up with two things. That photo you told me she was preserving you about and the pair of women's sunglasses. They must have fallen when Ox grabbed her. She's not she's not a dumb woman, Chip. She knows everything something is going on. <coughs> she doesn't know the half of it. If she did, she'd run all the way back to Dusty Springs and hang up her gun for good. The Clary Curse. Don't call it that, woman. You're no smart to believe in that hocus pocus. There are more things in heaven and earth. Whatever's going on is not supernatural. It's like work of people plain and simple. Just like it always is. And what's your part in all this? 
protecting the clergy, just like my daddy and his daddy before him. And that now includes kidnapping one of them. I'm telling you, that girl is an imposter. Sure, but which girl? The one I got. Not anymore, you don't. You sure we're the only ones in here? Don't go changing the subject on me. I'm telling you, there's more to all this than meets the eye. Unpack the books. Sure can. Check them out. Time to unpack these books. Give him his stuff. Wait, old man. I'm almost done. Okay. Nothing is is nothing in here, but a lot of bad luck and he, human foul. Phone's ringing. What do you mean she got away? You can't weigh more than her to light thigh. Then your left thigh. No, no. Just sit. Don't just sit there and bleed. I'll call the doc and we'll get you bandaged up. Not a word. I told you. Not a single word. I told that man nothing good would come of this. But does he listen? Nope. He likes to kidnap people. Digging up the past. Digging up. 
We've passed them. Is she gonna notice that she's hiding? Probably not. Charlotte, Charlotte. You were such a young, happy thing. What did those Clary boys do to you? So many secrets and no one left alive to share them. Except old Robert Prasad's, perhaps. She's seen where you hid the book. Sneak into the archives. stuff. Why are you being ignorant? <gasps> Don't do that, Jess. She's going across the fucking bookshelves. Mouse there for a second. Magazines that I'm out. A record a magazine. Sorry, you guys, I keep hearing something out the window. Wondering what it is. stars. Where is it? Where is it? Please be in here. Because it would take me a year to go through all these books. There it is. J.W. Clary and Chester McGovern. 
What is this? What's this say? I'm sure Charlotte kept the real evidence in her room rooms at the manor. The old manor? Why must it be a creepy old manor? Fine, I'll go, but not until morning. Besides, if I crash in the calf, maybe Jenny will be back. Go to it. The absence persimony. I don't know. That's a big word. Hello. Jenny, don't do that. Hello? Hello? Jake told me you might have a room available? Yeah, that's why the lights are off and I just broke in. Great, I guess no one's coming back here anytime soon. Gah! If I had the paddle back into that sh calf tonight, I swear I'll just die. Maybe I'll start a fire get the fire going just crumble up paper when make fine kindling these logs look good when they are burnt in time matches I can light the fire with them She's gonna fall asleep right there. Now we're going back to the calf. But we'll go back to the calf. Not the calf. I think that's the diner. But we'll go back to the diner in the next episode. I will see you all lovelies in the next video. Bye guys.